Colorado's leading election rigging conspiracy theorist got arrested today. Video shows Republican Mesa County Clerk Tina Peters appearing to attempt to kick a law enforcement officer. She struggled with police. They had come for her iPad. She's accused of improperly recording a court hearing and then lying to a judge about it. Here's Steve Staker. So much has happened in the lead up to these few moments in a bagel joint in Grand Junction. It would be tough to sum it up on TV. That's Tina Peters, the Mesa County clerk, a hero in the election conspiracy theory world. Peters is the subject of investigations, both locally and federally, for allowing someone access to her county's voting systems, who later took that data to conspiracy theorists. But what happened here today in the shade of a tree inside Main Street Bagel in Grand Junction actually started yesterday in a Mesa County courtroom. Peters was in the gallery for a hearing for her deputy clerk, Belinda Nicely, charged with cyber crimes after prosecutors say she illegitimately gained access to computers in the clerk's office while she was suspended. This photo of that hearing yesterday was included in the search warrant. It shows Peters there in the front row behind an iPad. The search warrant says the judge asked her if she was recording the proceeding. Peters denied she was. Others saw her doing it, which led to the warrant and led police to the bagel shop this morning to seize Peter's iPad. Let go of me! A witness caught the moment on video as Peter struggled with officers, even attempting to kick one of them. It hurts! Let go of me! Give me my key! Oh, oh, you understand? Stop it! Sorry. The Grand Junction Police Department says Peter's was arrested and released on scene pending charges. Grand Junction police tell us that they expect an arrest affidavit will be filed soon, which could tell us if Peters might face any charges for her struggle with police this morning. The search warrant for Peters iPad indicated she could be charged with attempting to influence a public servant for recording that hearing. It's a class four felony, Kyle. A felony charges, no joke. I mean, Steve, I think everybody's parents at one point uh, told them when you're in a hole, stop digging. Yeah, you think about it, there are, there's the local investigation into what might have happened inside her office. There's the federal investigation into what might have happened inside her office. Then you throw on top of it the arrest of her deputy clerk, the court hearing here. She's caught apparently recording that hearing. And then on top of it might be facing charges for doing something in that arrest with police officers. Yeah, still haven't figured out what the FBI might have pulled out of her home back in November as well. Steve, thank you.